Hey, what's up, guys? It's Toast with Toasty Tabletop Games. Today, I've got the last of my Double Masters box, and hopefully we can get the stuff I'm still looking for. So I'm still looking for things like Allosaurus, Shepard, uh, Phyrexian, Altar, extra copies of things like Smothering Tithe, stuff like that. Um, but hopefully we get it, you know? I, I'm not really opposed to getting other stuff as long as it, as long as it can wow me. <laughs> All right, so yeah, here, we get our, yeah, we'll do like this. So like last time, we'll do the two things there. So we got our soldier cat dragon and we got our cryptic spires. And uh, we'll take the hollows and the rares, put them back here. And we'll go, go from there. So we got stagger shock, rancor, it's actually awesome. I didn't even know rancor got reprinted in this. Uh, go for the throat, blood water entity, spark mages gambit. Ballastrad Spy, Relief Captain, Makeshift Mauler, Fiery Fall, Elvish Reju Rejuvenator, Ingenious Scab, Nefalia Smuggler, 10th District Legionnaire, hollow there too, uh, Gifts Ungiven, Let's, that's hype actually, that's actually so hype. Uh, I kind of wish I had the original art for Gifts Ungiven, but on, Gifts Ungiven is such a cool card with such, so, like a lot of hist so much history, so that's a really cool card to pull. And then we have Hostage Taker, which is actually a really another really great rare. I'm, actually, I'm pretty happy with that first pack there. Alright, going into our second pack here. Alright, so once again, we're gonna take our two tokens. We got our boar, boar uh, treasure, double sided in our cryptic spires, and we're gonna take our hollows and rares. Put them on the back. All right, we got Inquisition of Kozilek, Spo uh, Sprouting Thernax, Bloodbraid Elf, Dreg Mangler, Unearth, Sensor Splicer, Forbidden Alchemy, Stormfleet Pyromancer, Tusk Guard Captain, Augur Spree, Hero of the Games. Got a hollow full art gruel turf there. Pretty, that's really pretty. Uh, Myth realized hollow. Imperial archangel. And bedlam reveler. I'll take our two rares and set them over here. All right, pack three. All right, we got our cat dragon, our spirit token of the cryptic spires. We're gonna take our four cards, put them on top. Then we got Extract from Darkness, Abyssin Falconer, Rakdos Carnarium, Brindle Shote, Settle Beyond Reality, Strands of Undeath, Militia Bugler, Aven Initiate, uh, Webweaver Changeling, Quasly Pride Mage, Living Lightning, Rampant Grove Full Art, uh, fall, uh, ugh, full art Hollow there, really pretty. Uh, Einok Bondkin Hollow, and a Metal of Fate Shifter. Very nice on the box and everything. I've lost many games to Anna Metal, so uh, <laughs> having one of her, I guess, is uh, I guess pretty. That's pretty cool. <laughs> kind of sucks. Well, I'm, well, she doesn't suck. She's really good, but uh, she's really good for a good reason. That's why I've lost her many times to her, right? So, and then we have our Grave Crawler. Oh, that's cool. You can just get recursion like easy. Pretty cool. Or we got our Angel Drake token and our Cryptic Spires. We're gonna take our four cards here. We got Scale Blessing, a Lot Left Troll, Skin Render, Martial Glory, Severed Strands, Seeker of the Way, Jeskai Elder, Skeleton Archer, Thrive, Call to the Feast, Dark Dweller Oracle. Lightning Bolt Hollow, real classic. Can never go wrong playing one. <laughs> oh jeez, got my stuff all mixed up. Uh, Webweaver Changeling Hollow. Gave Guru, uh, Guru of Spores. He's like some one-one counter nonsense. Hmm. He just like, hmm. okay, so he like pumps out tokens and like puts more counters on stuff. That's kind of cool. 
Uh, yeah, so you enter with five counters on him, and you pay one to remove one, and you create some tokens. Then you can pay one and sacrifice those tokens to put counters back uh, on the third creature. So you can kind of spread the wealth there. Set that over there. And then uh, we have our Hydroid Crassus. So it's whenever you cast a spell, you gain half of X life and draw X cards when you round down each time. It's got flying and trample and it enters with uh, X one one counters on it. Okay, so you know, that's not a bad creature either, actually. Especially since you get cards from it, uh, gain life. I mean, the gain of life is negligible, but the getting the cards and uh, scaling, you can dump all the mana into it is, is pretty good. <clears throat> So we got a Sapperling token with vampires and a cryptic spire. Set that over here. And we're gonna take our four cards, put them on top. Alright, we got one more pack after this one, so hopefully we got some cool hits in these. So we got Summer Bloom, Ether Mage's Touch, Gruel Turf, Awful Art, Agony Warp, Bloodflow Connoisseur, Battlefield Promotion, Deranged Assistant, Liliana's Elite, Rampant Growth with the original art. Always a Always a treat. I really like this art. I, I wasn't sure about it at first, <laughs> but it kind of it's kind of grown on me. Uh, Fireblade Artist, Pirate's Pillage, Bounty of the Luxa uh, foil, Hissing Iguana foil, Doran the Siege Tower. I have a couple of him already, but he's pretty cool since uh, you can basically just play huge creatures that have really high toughness and then to swing in for stupid amounts of damage. Then we have uh, Skullbriar the Walking Grave. It deals combat damage, but 1-1 one, one counters. And then uh, counters remain on it as, as it moves from one zone to any... Oh, wow. That's crazy. So you can just he can just scale like the whole game if he's your commander. That's actually really cool. That's a really cool card. That's insane. <laughs> I, think I, I think I have something in mind for him. All right, so now we're in our final pack here. And hopefully get another uh, crazy big hit or something like that. <laughs> we have a boar, a treasure token, cryptic spires. We'll set them over here. And we're going to take our four, put them on top. All right, here we go. So you got uh, Scab Clan Giant, Prophetic Bolt, Is It Boiler Works, Glow Spore Shaman, Doomed Traveler, Spell Pierce Full Art, Supernatural Stamina, Experiment 1, Augur Spree, Monastery Swift Spear, Grapple with the Past, Kazmina's Transmutation Foil, Winged Kotal Foil, Dragon Lord Dramoka. I do have another one of these already, so that kind of sucks, but it's okay. Uh, Uncounterable Flying Lifelink, and you know, that, that let, lets opponents not cast spells during your turn. I mean, that's kind of, it's, it's really good for what it is still, so no complaints there. And then we have uh, Rishkar Pima Renegade. And when it enters the battlefield, it puts a counter on each of two creatures, and each creature with a counter on it is a mana dork now. That's <laughs> that can be kind of cool. Just turn all of your 1-1 uh, one, one counter dudes into a bunch of fun little mana dorks. But uh, yeah, that's kind of all for today's video. We got some cool stuff, but uh, not really anything I was looking for, unfortunately. Uh, I think the coolest thing we got there was probably like the Gifts Ungiven. That was a real treat uh, to see a card like that. Uh, Skullbriar is really cool. Um, Animatal is really cool too. Uh, Gave is kind of cool. Uh, Gravecaller, neat. Yeah, I think yeah. Gifts on given. Gifts on given in the uh, Skullbriar and Animatal are definitely my favorites there. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe for more content like this. And as always, follow me on my socials at Toasty Tabletop Games on Instagram, TikTok, and Twitch. Other than that, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one.